I wasn't really sure what I wanted to start posting. I know I like vlogging, but recently I just kind of had this epiphany that I need to lean into my niche for fitness. August was a rough month for me. As hard as I tried, I couldn't stay consistent with my goals. I was going to the gym, but something was off. I was missing key components to my journey. Since I wasn't sticking to my promises, I was losing respect for myself. August through November were months that were packed with life lessons, so I focused on my security and happiness first. Now that I've hit reset, I'm ready to come back. And while 2023 was a time for growth, so is 2024. So we're being a lot more intentional this time around. it's honestly like damn near dangerous to be going to the gym right now but i have to do what i have to do it's monday i don't know why but lately it's been raining it just feels good to get out of the coziness i don't know putting baggy sweats on baggy hoodie on about to get a good leg pump this is a different kind of feeling and i want to have that i wanted to pick my camera back up the viewfinder was like unscrewed so it was falling off i knew exactly how to fix it but i've been procrastinating making long form content is nerve-wracking even though i'm nervy i'm gonna just do it because i love to do it so welcome to my room ignore the laundry it's clean i have to put it away this morning hey guys so it's the next day a lot happened yesterday first of all it was flooding didn't go to the gym chose my safety i am dressed now i'm wearing these purple gym shake leggings they're super cute my friend Alyssa gave them to me so yeah i'm kind of off my off my game right now but i'm the type of person to like only want to film only want to make content when things are perfectly laid out for me and i realize that's not always going to be the case so i just kind of have to make the content so got my gym bag my bed's not made um i literally just got home from my boyfriend's what time is it it's 11 11 oh angel numbers we're meant to be here together I'm just gonna fill my water up, get my pre-workout, grab a banana, and then I'm gonna head out. I guess I'll take you guys along with me for my first workout of the week, Tuesday, January 23rd. No matter how many days I try to do this, I'm waiting for a package. So I can open it with y'all. Good morning, Katie. Today is Wednesday, January 24th. Right. Guys, look at my cute little setup. My man let me use his old PlayStation. So, you know, now I got a nice cozy little setup. This morning, today, my plan is to open that package with y'all and get into the gym because I know what I ordered and I'm excited to wear a certain item. But the first step is to get some water and some food in me because I cannot go to the gym without eating. I've been doing that lately and I've been struggling. I literally went to the gym off one banana and then i left and i had a migraine so it was like a whole thing so yesterday i had a moment where i was having cravings oh i forgot i got the wow i really thought for my future self we're gonna be trying this protein after my workout got some gator light which is my favorite oh my god actually we're gonna make this breakfast sandwich that i made yesterday it was so good. It was literally to die for. But I wanted to show y'all what else I got. <laughs> spicy noodles. I can't even handle spicy noodles. So I don't know why I got that. It was just kind of like a random craving I was having. But let's make this breakfast sandwich. So easy. The easiest ingredients. And it's so good. <gasps> Guys, I just saw the FedEx truck. <laughs> My package is here. Woo -woo. I'm gonna show you what else I'm gonna use for my breakfast. That way, if y'all wanna try to make this, you can. I'm gonna be using cherry tomatoes, which I bought these for a salad. And I only made the salad one time because it was just so time consuming. Roasted garlic hummus. It's a really nice dip to have hummus. I, I eat it with those little pretzel snack things. 
and then we're using eggs and bacon and toast. Before I go ahead and open this package, I just wanted to say that over the past couple days of trying to pick my camera up, I realized that I don't do a lot in my day. I think I'm just gonna start vlogging throughout the week and then compiling any clips I get together. But there's definitely gonna be some good stuff, so stick around the video. I know I haven't really been doing a whole lot, but I'm trying to get it together and we're gonna get it together together. <laughs> oh, also these are the seasonings I'm using. Everyday seasoning. I realized that the bacon would probably be loud, so I'm, I'm over here now. This is my Prozies box, guys. If you don't know, um, Prozies has been sending me things since, um, since like August, I want to say. It was the first brand that ever partnered with me, which was really big because my whole life I've wanted to partner with brands. This is active wear and active items, so it makes me even more happy. Now that I've been getting sent things from Prozies, I kind of know what I like. I've really been liking these. They're kind of just like a fat burner. And we got some clothing items. I got like, I think I got a top and a sports bra and pants, which y'all look at this color. Oh, we're about to get into it. And the Holy Grail. <laughs> they always let me pick snacks and this is like the only snack that I'll actually eat. So <laughs> I got four boxes. Chocolate protein waffles. The only thing is like, it's in a different language. 30 grams of protein in each waffle, y'all. That's crazy. So good. My toast is done. back and I changed. I literally love these leggings. I used to get their high-waisted products but I found out I'm a regular waist girly like this waist just looks more flattering on me. Anyways though we are about to make some pre-workout and then head to the gym. But like I said before we're gonna grab one of these. I've actually been getting a lot of questions about the pre-workout that I like. Lately I've been using Alani which it's really good don't get me wrong but this flavor is just not it and I usually get her from Walmart so like they don't always have all the flavors stocked. I've tried the Cosmic Stardust, I think it's called, and I've tried the Witch's Brew. Um, this one's probably number three, and Witch's Brew second. Cosmic Starbu Starburst is so good. Like, when I see that again, I'm getting it. Way easier than a shot. If you can't tell, I love chocolate and we're feeding the period cravings this week. Hey guys, I'm back in the gym. Back in the gym. I'm back in the car. Uh, today was super good. These pants definitely like fueled half my workout. I tried this and 10 out of 10. Tastes like chocolate milk. 10 out of 10. Hey, hey, just got home. Literally about to import this footage and then I realized I can give you guys a haul of what I got at Target. So my skin's been suffering a lot lately and when I went to my friend Katie's house, um, you saw her at the beginning of this video. Um, she had this Aztec clay mask. It was so good. I want to try to incorporate face masks into like my nightly every other night routine. I got tampons because I never get them in time and then I end up needing them and having to go out while I'm on my period and it's just not the vibe. The last two things I got were just some body wash because I was out and then I got this cute nail polish. So I'm going to import this footage and I will change my camera and see you guys when I pick it up next. <laughs> 